<clears throat> hey, what up everybody? It's me, Donnie the Chili Man, sir, back with another uh, hot sauce review video. Uh, this one is a local sauce that I'm trying. Uh, this is the Springfield Trading Company presents, what is this? Billy's Raging Garlic Hot Sauce. Uh, it's got a dude on the front. Kind of looks like Ethan Rivera or somebody. Um, I got this at the farmer's market over the summer and I just haven't made a video on it yet. Um, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna read the, the little blurb on the side of it and, and then I'll try it for you and I'll tell you what I think about it. Um, I'm Billy Dove, that's what it says. It says, I'm Billy Dove and I'm passionate about showcasing and supporting all things local in Springfield and the surrounding 417 area. Neat, me too. I don't know who this Billy Dove guy is. To be fair, I moved to Cincinnati for two years and I don't watch regular TV, I don't watch the news. Um, I have a love for great hot sauce, so this collaboration with Springfield Trading Company was only natural. I like a hot sauce that not only brings the heat, but has great flavor. I hope you enjoy the flavors of Raging Garlic. So uh, it's Raging Garlic Hot Sauce. I was like, dude, I love hot sauce. I love garlic. I love Springfield and the 417. So naturally, I had to have this. So I got this hot sauce, and uh, and uh, let's let's take it. Oh, let's open it up here. I do smell garlic. They are correct. There is garlic in here. It definitely smells like garlic. Garlic is in there, like very garlicky. Um, almost sweet. What's it got in there? Aged red peppers, carrots, onions, distilled vinegar, garlic, lime, salt, xanthan gum. Um, as you can tell, it's it's a, your basic hot sauce. So, so I've got my trusty magical spoon here. I'm going to uh, I'm gonna try a little bit of it here. Let's take a just pierce the pour. All right, yeah. Let's try this. And it's garlicky. It's garlicky. Um, it kind of tastes like it's got, it's like a garlicky Tabasco. It's not really anything to write home about. First time I tried it, I tasted it and I was like, oh, this is gonna be, it's called Raging Garlic, you know, it's gonna be awesome. I taste it and I was like, wow, there's like no heat at all to this, like whatsoever. Um, but then I looked on the back, it says, Heat level seven out of 10. I'm like, that is not true. Um, all natural, vegan. Um, but then I looked on the front here and it started to make more sense to me. Uh, if you take a look right there, it's got a, if you can see it, it's got a Bloody Mary on the front of that. So obviously this was intended, uh, or at least it's being marketed uh, for the only use I would be able to think of it too, which is put it in your Bloody Mary. With that in mind, this is great. This is a great sauce if you're looking for something for a Bloody Mary. If you're looking for a hot sauce for food, you probably want to look somewhere else. But this, uh, for a Bloody Mary, I would say that's cool. Plus, you got to support people who like local stuff. So, um, although I haven't heard about you, I don't know who you are or whatever, uh, Billy and the guys over at Springfield Trading, um, you know, keep on doing what you're doing. We need, it takes all types of people to uh, to form a community. So this has been a quick, I don't know, four minute hot sauce review. Uh, this is Donnie the Chili Man, sir. If you haven't already, hit like, subscribe, share the video, do all that stuff. Join my Discord server, which is gonna be down in the description box. And uh, also check out some of the links to the other channels that I watch. Some of my friends like Fundamentals of Heat and uh, I don't know, the, the Lifeboat. I always watch the Lifeboat. So anyway, I'll see you guys later. Have a wonderful day, bye.